Hi, this is Mark Abus from XRM Cubed with the fourth in our video series, Microsoft Dynamics CRM Basics for Sales Professionals. We've already covered CRM from the perspective of sales representatives responsible for actually closing those sales. In this video, we'll address CRM basics for sales managers. Microsoft Dynamics CRM provides several ways to manage and help your sales team get the results your organization needs. To keep things simple, let's look at four CRM basics that will help you manage your sales team effectively. Tracking sales related activities of individuals and teams, reviewing, revising, and taking action on sales pipeline, analyzing sales history, and working with sales management reports. We'll look at some common sales scenarios to illustrate the management objectives listed above. Activities are all the things your team does in pursuit of a sale. Things like phone calls, emails, appointments, and so on. There are multiple ways to keep up with your team's sales related activities using Dynamic CRM. Activity records live in your CRM lead, opportunity, contact, and account records. Activities are displayed in chronological order. Look for open and completed sales activities like phone calls and appointments for the entire sales team or for individual salespeople. Here's an example of activities displayed in the lead record. Use the collaboration tools in Microsoft Dynamics CRM to get your team working together, communicating in a social network style of interaction. Posts in the CRM social pane resemble posts in familiar apps such as Twitter or Facebook. Following on the experience of social sites your team members are used to, these posts display not just in the lead or opportunity record, but also in the individual's What's New page. CRM users can easily schedule future tasks for themselves or other team members right within the relevant CRM record. In this scenario, salesperson Veronica creates a task for her team member Sanjay, provides Sanjay with a description of what's needed to be done, as well as a due date. This task will appear in the related CRM record as well as on Sanjay's activity view. A key metric that sales managers routinely focus on is sales pipeline. Dynamic CRM provides managers with a complete view of forecasted sales with the ability to segment the pipeline by product, by territory, by salesperson, or by sales stage. In this example, the sales pipeline is displayed as a sales funnel segmented by sales stage. Potential sales in the blue portion of the funnel are in the leader qualifying stage. The brown section represents opportunities in the develop stage and the purple section represents opportunities in the proposed stage. Click on the funnel to uncover the underlying data and to view the individual deals that comprise the entire pipeline. In this view, the pipeline is displayed in a manner that is similar to an Excel spreadsheet. Resort or filter columns to narrow down the pipeline view. For instance, you may only want to look at deals with a success probability of 50% or higher, or are closing in the current month. Click on any single line item to drill down to an individual sales opportunity. Now you're in the opportunity record. Check on the most recent phone calls or appointments. Use this information to take action. Follow up with the sales rep that owns the opportunity or reach out directly to the customer. As sales manager, you have the permissions to change values in the record such as estimated close date or estimated revenue. Any changes you make will roll up to the pipeline forecast in real time and be reflected in any view, dashboard, or report. Sales history can be accessed in multiple ways. Choose which way is most practical based on how you want to analyze sales or manage your team. Select the One Opportunities view to see a spreadsheet style display of previous sales sortable by customer or sales revenue. Refer to the bar chart on the right to see total sales per customer. Click on an individual customer bar in the chart to pull up their sales orders. Export the report to Excel if that's your preference. You've now got a spreadsheet ready for further modification, reformatting, printing, whatever you need. 
Stock reports are available anytime, featuring real-time sales data. You can group sales data in the sales report to sort by month, owner, territory, etc. Click once more to pull up the detailed report, in this example sorted by owner. Well, I hope you found this introduction to Dynamic CRM for Sales Managers valuable and gets you on the way to making your team more productive and successful. There's a lot more to cover in future videos. For a comprehensive training or CRM implementation, go ahead and contact us today using the information you see right here. Thanks for your time.